warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and greetings for ladies and gentlemen my name is Daniel Izzuddin Bin Muhammad Shahir and I'm about to talk to you about a system where our polytechnic used to record the movement of students in and out from the institution so in polytechnic there's about 1100 students who live in the campus each and one of the students can also go in and out from the polytechnic from 9 a.m. in the morning to 7 p.m. in the afternoon so the students can also go back to their hometown every weekend and they have been, been given permission uh, for the students to go back home if there is any emergency during the school hour <laughs> I'm going to talk to you about the old technique that I've been using by this institution to record the name of the students that are going in and out from Polytechnic. So, the old technique that we are using is actually just write their own names on the guard post. So, this problem also comes with many types of problems. Some of it is actually the students need to wait for a longer time. So, if there are many students that want to go out from the institution, the other students need to wait in back of the line and the guard post will become very crowded. Next is also, there are naughty type of students who would like to make problems with the institution, of course. The students uh, will write, not write their own name in the book, but the other students that doesn't want to go out from the institution. And the students that doesn't want to go out from the institution will give a big problem to the polytechnic. And it's actually very impossible for a guard to remember every faces that comes in and out from the institution because there are just too many of them. In order to prevent this problem from happening, uh, our student made an, inno an innovation which is they create a system for students to enter and exit from campus. Students can enter their IC number and their or scan their uh, card metric uh, through the website. Solve the problem from overcrowding in the guard hut. This will also prevent the fraud of writing the names of other students because the system follows the system in polytechnic. In addition, this innovation can make it easier for the warden to monitor the entry and exit for students and it also easy to track students who enter the campus lab. I would like to present about our system. Alright, so the system has three user level which are warden, guard and master student. Okay, for the model display, the first pass username and password. Alright. Also, you can see uh, at the interface. So, at the warden interface, so warden can check record for the entry student. You see here. And warden also can check existing student, exit student. Okay. And other also can check student who enter late, for example, after uh, 7 o'clock, right? So uh, just click here. Okay, so uh, then just just uh, input the date here and let's say I try. So uh, you can see here the data of student, uh, record of student uh, who can enter in the lake to the hostel, right? Okay. Uh, for the uh, guard interface, alright. For the guard interface, so uh, you must put a username and password also, alright. Okay. Alright. So uh, at this uh, interface, student must put their metric number or their IC number, right? So uh, let's say I give a uh, example. Okay. Okay, so you can see here there's a student uh, appear a student who exit uh, uh, for the hostel, right? So uh, there's a uh, name, the yeah, metric number, and also a uh, room name, right? Okay, this system is very efficient to uh, execute in our polytechnic and very uh, assist a student uh, and uh, warden to control their student in to monitor their student right uh, thank you very much that's all for me